Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. Question 74. The dedicated space above a panel board extends to a dropped or suspended ceiling, which is considered a structural ceiling. Now is this true or false? The last few questions we've had some true false ones and some definitions. And those are the easy type questions and it's nice to get those on your test especially after some of the ones where we've had to do a lot of looking. Now this one is going to take just a little more than the average true false question to get the answer but we're still going to get this faster than average. We can look at maybe dedicated space, panel board, suspended ceiling, structural ceiling. I'm going to look for panel board because that's really kind of the electrical thing and I'm going to head that direction with it. Here we are in the index at panel boards, article 408. We're going to look for something that deals with dedicated space or a ceiling or something of that nature. So let's go down and as we scroll down our page we find something pretty interesting here. Here's spacing minimum. Well. I like this better, working spaces about. So it's asking or telling about the working spaces around a panel board. And that would include the ceiling space as well. So let's go to 120.26. Okay, I said 120.26, I meant 110.26, spaces about electrical equipment. So we're going to have to scroll down these bold headings. And let's see if we find something that deals with a suspended ceiling or any kind of ceiling for that matter. Okay, we find here dedicated equipment space. And our question starts off with the de dedicated space above a panel board. So this looks like a good place. Now we start going through, we start seeing uh, these smaller italic headings. So we have to go through there and let's see what we can find there that looks interesting. D suspended ceilings a dropped or suspended let me say that again a dropped suspended or similar ceiling that does not add strength to the building structure shall not be considered a structural ceiling so the statement for the question said that it was considered a structural ceiling but this is saying it shall not be considered a structural ceiling this makes the answer to question 74 false, which is choice B. Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. If you find this video helpful, please consider donating using the PayPal link below. Thank you.